Hi, I'm John Fitzgerald and welcome to this week's edition of Team Wealth Builders. Today I'm going to talk about what we call the Maya. Now, what is the Maya? It's the energy that surrounds us. And why I talk about it is there's so many people who are just swamped with negativity. In fact, I was reading a report that said that 94% of Australians constantly worry about their job and about their finances. So that's the energy that they're involved in that surrounds them. And it's no coincidence that 94% of Australians, how is this, retire with less than the median wage, on much, much less than the median wage. Now, what is it about that other 6% or what I call the 1% is, what do they do differently? Well, I'll tell you what I do differently. I get out of the Maya. I create my own Maya. And I use a saying, and I love this saying, environment is stronger than willpower. And this is so important for all of us as wealth builders. Because as wealth builders, you're going to be a one percenter, one in a hundred. So therefore, you're not going to be surrounded by other wealth builders. In fact, you're going to be surrounded by the 94% that are constantly worried about their finances, their job, debts, various things like that. And they have this drama and worry in their life, and that can affect you. They bring you down to their level. And let me give it a perfect example of it. It's like environment stronger than willpower. Let's say I want to give up smoking. It's no point me standing outside my office, hanging around smokers, if I'm trying to give up smoking. If I'm trying to give up drinking, it's no point me going to the pub with all my friends who are drinking while I'm trying to give it up. Because that environment, after a little while, will just wear you down. You've got to create the environment for yourself every year, just as a by the by. Every year I go to India. And people say, why do you go to India? I go up into the Himalayan mountains and hike. And it's what we call hypoxic because I get to a level where it's maybe 3,000 meters above sea level and the air's a little bit thinner so you get a, a beneficial effect of just hiking around the mountains. But what I really love about it more than anything else is the mire up there is just beautiful. There's no worry, there's no tension, there's no anxiety. And it's amazing because you come back to Australia and you're almost a different person looking at the world differently. And that's what wealth builders need to do and be. You know, there's a saying, be in this world but not of this world. So don't get attached. And the th three things that we attach ourselves to, one are attachments, might be people, things, goods, etc. The other are our beliefs and our fears. And these can take up a lot of our conscious energy. And really what I'm saying is, the Maya, create an environment around yourself which isn't daily determined by your attachments, beliefs and fears. Start to put other things into your mind, into your creativity, into your home life that is around creating a, a congenial, peaceful feeling that allows you to go without and live without that anxiety. And I think that's really important. That's what the one percenters do. And let me leave you with one last saying. Where there is creativity, there can be no worry. And where there is worry, there can be no creativity. And certainly the one percenters are creative. And the one thing I do creatively every single day is I use my visualization. And if you like some more information on that, I can send you a copy of my Focus CD. Just something to think about. Have a great day. Thanks for listening to me.